Hello and welcome to Powder Simplify, a segment where we take automotive concepts and break them down into bite-sized pieces so you can digest them easily. Now speaking of digesting, today's topic is about oils. And no, it is not a vegetable or an extra virgin olive oil. In this episode, we look at the different types of engine oils. Synthetic, semi-synthetic and mineral oil. Which one should you go for? What good quality bike engine oil can do is lower fuel consumption, reduce carbon emissions, enhance engine protection and minimize wear and tear. These are qualities that every ELF engine oil delivers, regardless of whether it is a synthetic, semi-synthetic or mineral engine oil. Just to hear it from the horse's mouth, we asked the experts at ELF, a brand with over 50 years of legacy in motorsports, and this is how they have explained it. Engine oil has two major components, base oil and performance additives. Now the major constituent in the base oil and its quality defines whether the engine oil is classified as mineral, semi-synthetic or fully synthetic. The American Petroleum Institute, API, I'm sure you've heard this before, has classified base oils into five categories based on their quality and manufacturing process. Group 1 to Group 5 Mineral oil is your most basic engine oil as it uses the most rudimentary refining process of crude oil. Mineral oils are also a cost-effective solution to engine lubrication and protection. Elf Motor 4 Gold is a trusted mineral oil for your daily commutes. Mineral oil is broken down faster, hence you must change your bike's mineral oil at regular intervals for optimum engine performance. A shorter lifespan than the ELF Motor 4 Tech, a fully synthetic oil. You know, talking about fully synthetic oil, it is chemically engineered in labs and produced in factories. A synthetic oil includes special additives that ensures performance at extreme ends of the temperature spectrum. A fully synthetic oil needs to be changed at longer intervals but costs more upfront when you buy one. Semi-synthetic is the best of both worlds. Like the ELF Motor 4 Road, it doesn't break down or oxidize as easily as a mineral oil and at the same time it doesn't cost as much as a synthetic oil. It's a mix of both and that's why it's called semi-synthetic. So which one do you choose? Let's look at the pros and cons. Fully synthetic oil may be more expensive, but it makes up for its cost with great engine protection, low sludge formation and long oil change intervals. Fully synthetic oil like ELF Motor 4 Tech is the best option for performance bikes because performance bikes run engines at very high temperatures. Semi-synthetic oil brings the best of both worlds. Not too expensive, but better at everything than mineral oil. Semi-synthetic oils like ELF Motor 4 Road are best suited for slightly higher capacity bikes and new gen commuter bikes. So there you have it. The type of engine oil you choose depends largely on the type of motorcycle and your usage of the motorcycle. Now, no matter what you do with your motorcycle, good quality engine oils like ELF have got your back with their range of synthetic, semi-synthetic and mineral oils. So if you are in the market for a great engine oil, go ahead and give the ELF range of engine oils a shot. Follow the link in the description to purchase your next bottle of ELF engine oil on Amazon. Next up, we discuss why an engine oil turns black and what does that mean for you. 